was goody everybody from the wind to you you know what it is and thank you very much for tuning in to another pokemon go guide today we're going to be talking about how to find and how to capture pokemon within pokemon go so as you guys can see there are two crabbies right next to me basically how to capture and how to find pokemon is pretty simple it's what the game's all intended to do is to get you out there in the world and travel around so as you guys can see i'm on an animated google maps and basically my goal is to continue walking around and as you guys can see there's another Pokemon that appeared within the Krabby being a female Nidoran. So there's a couple of ways to attract Pokemon to your location. One is to find these Pokestops that have Pokemon items which I've covered in a different video. And you can go ahead and tap on the top of it and attach a Pokestop module which is called a Lure module. What that would do is attract Pokemon to that given location and uh, give you a higher chance of finding new and unique Pokemon. So as you guys can see, another sand, sh uh, sand shrew just appeared. Uh, there's another way that you can also go ahead and attract Pokemon to your location by going to your items and dropping uh, what's called an incense. As you guys can see, I currently have one on, an incense with a mysterious fragrance that lures poke wild Pokemon to your location for 30 minutes. Similar to a lure module, but it's to your location. So you can walk around and do whatever you want. So pretty much um, how that would work is you're going to uh, attach the incense, as you guys can see, there's going to be a purple swirly smoke going around your character or your avatar, and you'll be able to attract wild Pokemon that way. Once you have found a given wild Pokemon, let's say I want to go ahead and capture an Ekans. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that Pokemon and how to capture the Pokemon. So it's going to start off with a Pokeball. Lucky me, I got lucky to get a CP10 Pokemon. So I'm not going to have to use a Great Ball and an Ultra Ball, but if I really wanted to switch, I'd go ahead and click the bottom right icon that looks like a backpack, switch to a Great Ball and Ultra Ball, and I'll be able to capture the Pokemon that way. But you can also use a Raspberry. It feeds the Pokemon to make it easier to capture. You might have to use uh, multiple during some different situations, but since I just got an Ekans at CP10, I'm going to go ahead and fling the Pokeball. Got that great because I got it within the green circle. Uh, the smaller it is, the more experience points you can get. You can get uh, good, great, or excellent. And since it is, again, CP10 and I've captured tons of these before, uh, it's going to be an easy capture for me. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, transfer this Pokemon because I've already captured plenty of them and I don't really need them. But as you guys can see here, we've got plenty of more Pokemon to capture. An Eevee, a Spearow, and a female Nidoran again. So again, if you want to capture and find Pokemon, uh, best to do so is find a Pokestop and attach a lure module to that that'll attract Pokemon to that Pokestop for 30 minutes, or attach an incense to your avatar that'll uh, attract Pokemon to your given location for 30 minutes, and be sure to, if needed, uh, you have Pokeballs, which are the easiest balls to use, Great Balls if your uh, Pokemon's going to be harder to capture, or Ultra Balls being the best balls that you can use against a given Pokemon, and be sure to use Raspberries if and when needed uh, just like using a ultra ball situation so let's see let's say you found a Snorlax in the wild or Gyarados you're definitely going to be using a uh, ultra ball with a couple of raspberries so without further ado thank you very much for tuning in don't forget to check out the description box down below I got tons of wild Pokemon coming at me today I'm getting lucky over here and uh, stay tuned for some more content brought to you by For the Win Itachi have a wonderful day peace out